entertained? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is my review for Victor Frankenstein. Now, this movie really should have put called Igor for really the whole movie. It should have been just it should have been called Igor. All right. This movie is all about Igor. He begins off as a circus clown. You know, he's made fun of. He's a hunchback. He has a lot of problems. Everybody there, they're all making fun of him because you know he's a monster to them. And well, he comes across. Uh, oh, and he's played by Daniel Radcliffe. Harry Potter himself is playing Igor, and he's a very fun choice to play Igor. I think he did a really good job in this movie. That's me. He was fine. The acting is fine in this movie. And then he comes across uh, James McAvoy's character, Victor Frankenstein, who is this guy who finds a lot of... He, he puts a lot of faith in the Igor. He looks at him and he says, there's potential here and I'm going to break you out of the circus. So what does he do? He breaks him out of the circus and now they are working together to change mankind as they know it from stopping death and making people immortal. He knows the whole story about Frankenstein's monster. He wants to bring a monster to life to prove that there is life after death. We all know the story. All right, we get that story. This movie should be called Igor, though, because to char this is like uh, Charlie, like in the Chocolate Factory, like how the movie was called Willy Wonka, called Willy Wonka in the Chocolate Factory, but it was more about Charlie. It's kind of like that. This movie's more about Igor, but it is called Victor Frankenstein, because Victor Frankenstein's the kind of guy who's there, who shows a lot of character and stuff, but he's not really the main focus of the story. So this is a new take on Frankenstein, in which I really enjoyed. This movie's getting a lot of, it's not really getting a lot of hate, because no one's when I've not seen it. So I would suggest you go out and see this movie before you just go ahead and say this is a bad movie. This is not a bad movie. This is a really fun movie. It's not I, Frankenstein. It's not even... It's none of those really bad, crappy uh, monster movies that they tried to remake. You know what I mean? I really enjoyed Dracula Untold. For me, this was this was like watching The Last Witch Hunter, which was a very bad movie. This is a way better movie than The Last Witch Hunter, though, in my personal opinion. The Last Witch Hunter was so... It was, it was a fun, bad, cheesy movie. Alright, I really enjoyed The Last Witch Hunter, and it got a lot of shit, and that's fine. I understand why I did. But this movie is a really good new take on Frankenstein. I really thought this movie worked really well. It told an Igor's perspective on how Victor Frankenstein went to a madman, and how he let this thing control him, how he wanted this experiment to change his life and change the world. And it slowly drove Victor into madness, and this is about Igor trying to bring his friend back from madness. And I thought this was a really, really fun movie. It didn't have to be great, it didn't have to be spectacular, but it was a good new turn on Frankenstein's story and Igor's story. Because Igor was never really a main character, he was just a sideshow clown that we'd all look at and kind of get creeped out by. But here, here he's not creepy, he's a really lovable character, in my personal opinion. I found a lot of interest in this movie. Yeah, there's flaws with the movie, of course. There's always going to be flaws with these remakes and reboots, but... Overall, this is a very fun movie. Not, not really what I was expecting. I actually had a fun time watching this movie. Depends on it. I would give Victor Frankenstein Igor. I'm gonna call it Igor because I know it's more about Igor than Victor Frankenstein. But let's just say Victor Frankenstein is gonna get a B minus. It's 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 a it's a fun it's a fun little time at the movie theaters. It didn't have to be spectacular. It didn't have to be magnificent. But at least make it my money's worth. And. I had a fun time. It was fun. It was enjoyable. It wasn't great. It was enjoyable. Enjoyable. So guys, comment down below and let me know your thoughts. Do you guys want to see this movie? Do you guys even care? Let me know down below. I'm really curious to hear your thoughts on this movie. And go check it out, please. I, I, I don't think you'll be disappointed in it. I think you'll be surprised. Surprised. So guys, follow me on MoviePile.com. Follow me on Twitter. Be friends with me on Facebook. And as guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate your views. Thanks.